Yo, welcome back to the channel guys. Today, we will take a closer look at Alter's version of Edmund Dantes, an Avenger class servant from the ever popular game, Fate Grand Order. Yup, another Fate video, right? Anyways, that is the art. Yup, back and the other side. He actually looks pretty cool. Anyways, let's go unbox him. Alright, he is out of his box, and you can actually uh, mix it up. Oh no. Let me... Right. So that scarf kind of fell off. Yeah, anyways, you can mix and match. He does come with a tie, a scarf, and a cloak. Oh, and uh, his right arm is also detachable, and you can replace it with a different arm. And here's his cloak. Let's actually take a closer look at his other one. Yeah, badass anime pose. See? There. Alright, let's see. Uh, let's take this off. And this off this one on and we should be able to put on the cloak or his overcoat uh, I think you got to take this off actually <laughs> right Let's see if we can press it down a little bit so his side can fit Yeah, maybe his tie does go in. Let me let me check real quick. Right. Mm, nope. I'm just being dumb. Yeah. So you can't have anything on him when you're putting the cloak. I put his head on like so. And there you go, see? It's pretty cool. I like it. Wish they designed the, uh, or they designed it a little better in regards to, like, assembly, you know? But it is what it is. Let's put that on the side and put on his other arm, then his tie or scarf or whatever. And his head. There you go. This is what I'll stick with. So it looks pretty badass. Alright, now to put him on his base, which is actually pretty cool. It's like bricks, it's not boring. A basic base, like most of the uh, other Fate related videos or figures that I've done. Alright, there you go. Edmund Dantes. Time for a closer look. Wow. Look at the level of detail in this figure. Alter really, really always like, gets it right. Scarf is pretty cool. Uh, it is a very dynamic, or not very dynamic, but it is a dynamic figure. There are, looks like he's in a nice pose with movement scarf like swayed around wrinkles etc etc the details like the clothing and the shadowing the way they painted it so like even it uh even in like a constant light it does look like they're shadowing which is pretty nice 
again like the base it is just a like a brick road you know but it's a heck of a lot better than just a circular freaking summoning a circle that generally like shows in the show but yeah hair and his hat yeah, the, the detail is just all there and <laughs> yep all right guys M and Dantes by Walter Alright, end of the video as usual, I'll put up the pros and cons of what I personally think about this figure. Um, yeah, overall, I really did enjoy, I do enjoy this figure. It's really, really cool and you can like mix and match between his different ascensions, which, I don't know, it's fairly unique among like figures these days. Yeah, but he is kind of expensive. I'll post up a like screenshot of where you can currently get him for the cheapest. And uh, if you like this video, I'd appreciate a like, a subscribe, and I'll see you next time. See ya. Thanks.